Welcome back to Houston Life. Houston rock band 307 Departure made their debut at the iconic Firehouse Saloon four years ago. That venue is now closed, but the band has ventured on to become local favorites in and around Houston and beyond. They're about to perform right here in Studio B. First, we want to get to know the guys. We have Kellen Moore, Grayson Moore, brothers, and on the back row, we have Josh, Josh Russell, who plays drums, Ryan Vitti, lead guitar. Guys, welcome to the show. Thank you for having Thank us. You. And thanks to your parents, who are also here in studio. It takes a village, right? Yes, it does. First of all, let's talk about the name, 307 Departure. How did you come up with the name? And y'all were just 13 and 15 years old when this started. Yeah, so what happened was we were kind of sitting after our move from Casper, Wyoming. I'm gonna kind of set up the story a little bit, but we moved from Casper, Wyoming when we were young kids. And when we moved here and kind of got into the whole band endeavor, we were like, the hardest part of the whole challenge is coming up with a band name that someone hasn't come up with before. And so we sat back and looked at it, tossed through our you know, different options that we had, and all of a sudden we were like, well, we departed 307, which is the area code similar to 936281, whatever, you know, air, respective area code you have in Houston. And we decided we departed from 307. So I'm glad you did. I'm glad you made your way to the departure. H. We're seeing some images right now on the screen. Y'all look like full fledged rock stars. <laughs> and Kellen, your brother Grayson. Grayson, you're yes. a senior in high school, is that yes, right? Yes, sir, that's right. So yeah. you're missing school right now. <laughs> yeah. Oh, my teachers aren't too happy with me right now. But, uh, you know, duty calls, right? Well, I hope your teachers will. Uh, support your your talents and your endeavors. Did you and your brother always have this vibe musically? When did you realize that you both had something going on? Well, we, we started, you know, when we were younger kids, we played football and stuff down here and tried to get into sports. It just wasn't really our thing. You know, we once we started, he started in choir. At first, we were doing like little karaoke gigs at some local restaurants and stuff, but once he started choir, it really started to take off. We started to really develop as singers. And then uh, I picked up bass shortly after, and then he picked up guitar, and we just we started moving. We decided this is what we wanted to do. Wow, and fast forward, here you are performing, <laughs> about to perform on live TV. Ryan and Josh in the back row. Uh, Y'all are really busy, and the guys were just telling me during commercial break, essentially you're booked every single weekend through the end of the year? Yeah. Okay, what kind of adjustment has that been for your lives? For me, at least, it's, you know, thank God I don't have school on the weekends. I'm in school full time. I work and I don't even live around here anymore. So for the, you know, the blessing that it's on a weekend, it's been kind of a, I said, like a blessing. You know, I'm able to come home on the weekends, play my shows and go right back to school and work and do more homework. Oh my gosh. <laughs> and Ryan, you still find yourself looking forward to every single gig? I am, yeah, ever since the first one. I mean, I've got a work location that works great with our schedule, so... Every time we got a gig, they'll work around it for me. It's I, I think awesome. it's super cool. Well, and I know, again, this, uh, this type of work takes a lot of work and dedication. And guys, while you get ready to perform, here's a look at some of the upcoming shows. So their next performance is tomorrow, October 21st, performing for Michael Graves of The Misfits. And on November 19th and December 8th, at uh, all at Acadia Bar, Grill uh, I'm sorry, Acadia Bar and Grill. There you go. Tickets are available at the door. And, uh, you know, you should hear these guys because they are going places and opening up for all kinds of really well-respected national bands as well. So keep an eye on these guys. And in the meantime, what do you say we hear from 307 Departure with their song, Say It. Thank you. 
It's like I'm pulling my teeth, slamming the door. I've taken so much, I cannot take anymore. It's on the tip of my tongue, I just can't say it. The rhythm is there, you like the way that I play it. Pulling my teeth, slamming the door. I've taken so much, I cannot take anymore. It's on the tip of my tongue, I just can't say it. The rhythm is there, you like the way that I play it. I like the way that you say it. All right, Kellen, Grayson, Ryan, and Josh, AKA 307 Departure. Guys, that was awesome. Fantastic. Keep an eye on our website, by the way, HoustonLife.tv for more uh, gig dates and times.